We raised over $3,000 um, for teachers. We identified six schools um, that we wanted to give the money to. So six schools received $500 each. Two schools in Providence, two schools in Cranston, one school in Pawtucket, and one school in Central Falls um, is getting the $500. So you guys were one of those schools that were identified. Thank you very much and congratulations. And um, we just want you guys to continue to, even though it's very tough even now with COVID and all of the restrictions, um, to continue to be the blessings that you are and the bright stars that you are because you are touching people's lives. They may not realize it or see it right now, but hopefully you have made a connection, right? Because through PBIS, ultimately it's all about teacher-student relationships and connections, and then that, that carries through with them and follows them through high school. Um, that they remember you. You touch somebody's life. You're not going to touch them all, but hopefully you touch one of these little ones' lives that they remember you and you have a tremendous impact on them that they do something great in their community and in this world. So good job. Thank you. Thank you. So as I said, we were asked to select one name or names of Mary and Pedro and I. We chose to select one name. And I couldn't select another because too many of you are so awesome that I, I just couldn't do it. So we're <laughs> going to draw the names for the others. But the name that I chose to select is somebody that has gone above and beyond to ensure our health and safety, has worked countless hours beyond and above her contract, heart and soul, to support you and the children and the families barely eats lunch or goes to the bathroom on a regular basis. <laughs> and that would be, I think everybody can say it, Nurse Joanne. <laughs> Another one. <laughs> Can I have it? <laughs> Simone Butterworth. Yay! All right, let's pick something besides second grade. <laughs> 